Hello guys and welcome back. I'm now going to show you how to do a hairstyle called the fire rays. So basically we are going back to the bunny bay, how we started off with that. Um, we clipped the um, hair down from the centre down to the nape and then from across the ear to the sides. And then we created our ponytails, inside out ponytail. So we've got the one section, the two section, the three and the four. Guys, if you're a bit confused um, on how to do this, look back at the bunny bow and it explains it all in there. So basically, we're not doing the bunny bow in this one, we're doing the fire rose. So we've got our four sections, we're gonna clip three sections out of the way. And what we're gonna do with the first section, let's make sure we've got a nice clean section all brushed. And guys, again, this is so simple. So we split it into two, and we cross over, like so. Keep crossing over, like so. And what we do, we take our little sections and we pull them out. And it's creating this lovely curl. That's that one side then, and then do the other side. Like so. We don't want to be too neat, we want to be a little bit not so careful, if you know what I mean. Let's bring it right out, see all that lovely width coming out from there. That's your one section done. Bring down the next section and again we're going to brush that right through. Now what we're going to do here, we're going to split it into one, two, and three. Just going to do our normal basic plan. Cross over, like so. So we're working from the outside, in, outside, in, outside, in, outside, in. To the bottom. Okay. Right, so we're going to take our sections and pull them out. Just be a little bit careful because you don't want to lose the ends. So every bit of hair we're pulling out. Like so. Okay, and we're going to do the other side, the same. Again, don't be too neat. Like that. It's a bit of texture going on in there. So you can see it's all pulling out nicely. On this one, we're going to try and pull it out a little bit wider, as best as we can, as, it, as I'm holding right onto the bottom, otherwise we don't want to lose all that plat we've just created. If bits fall out, bits fall out, it will really add to the end result. So can you see? Okay, that's your second section down. Third section. Came that out. Now what we're going to do with this one, we're going to do the plait, but an inside plait. So you take your section. One, two, and three. So we're going under, rather than over, under. Okay, 
Okay, so the outside under, and the outside under in the middle, like so. Don't rush, just take your time. Okay, and then we're gonna pull the sections out. Okay, we're gonna try and pull it out as much as we can without losing the flat completely. Grab little bits out and then it will make it a bit more bigger as we're going up. Let's say, bring that to the camera. Okay. So we've got our one underneath, our two, and our three. And then the final one, the fourth one, again we're gonna brush that out. We're gonna split that into two, and we're just gonna go cross over once, all the way down. And this is the bit where we're gonna create our rays. Right, so we're gonna pull all this out now. We're gonna try and bring it out as best we can. It's a lot bigger than the rest. You can see that in the video. Right, now all we're going to do, we're going to literally wrap that round the top. And we're going to pin her in there. We need about three to four pens. Just make sure she's in secure. That's it. Okay. So we're gonna take our section. See what I'm doing? I'm just pulling it out a little bit now. And yes, I'm not holding the bottom, but I'm being very, very careful. Right. So we've got a section, and we're gonna literally just wrap that round our rows that we've just created and hide any bands. And again, same section. What we've done with the first. Just pull it out very, very gently because I'm not holding on to the bottom now. I'm just trying to create a bit more shape out of the plant that we've just created. Okay, and then we're gonna wrap that round. Just gonna wrap that one round there. And the last section, same as what we've done with the rest. Again, I'm not holding on to the bottom, but I'm being very, very careful. I'm gonna literally just wrap that right round. Like 
Sorry. Again, just pin her in. Move secure. And then, what we're going to do is just going to bring it out a little bit. And with the raise in the middle, what I tend to do is just lift it up slightly. And then get your pin. And just pin it right through. That just holds it up a little bit more. 